Hello everyone, welcome, welcome. Moving on to part four of our very casual Elden Ring playthrough. Hope you're all doing great today. I am in a lot of pain from my neck. Not sure what happened, but man, does it hurt. I'm just kind of dealing with that. And so what we're going to be doing now is just playing very casually. I'm going to be not moving my head any direction. And I'm just going to uh, beat up some bosses. I did forget to do a thing yesterday, though. I actually want to go here so I can get the the giant's uh, the giant's flame seal thing. I can't remember what it's called, but basically it enhances our fire damage, or at least I think it does. So let's go there and grab that, shall we? I forgot that I also have these here. Let's change that up real quick. Hope you're all having a good. What is it, Wednesday? Or is it Thursday? I think it's Thursday, isn't it? It is Thursday. Hope you're having a good Thursday. It's good to have you here. Let me just plug in a couple more things here. We want our lantern there and our horse here, as we do. As we do. Yes. Who do I see in chat? I see Girth Brooks, Daisy, MD Legendary, Jaden Brandon. Brandon Thomas, Lukito, Pibala, Eco Terrorist, Screamer, Greybeard. Why does my audio keep skipping? What is that? And well, now it's not doing it. Okay, good. Uh, Atska, Tyler, it just it just did it again. Son of a Oh, there it is again. Do you guys hear that audio skip as well? Is that a thing you guys hear too? Right there. What is that? What's up, Jalen? What's up, Mr. Balls? Richard, Hebel, Bebel, Janet. Welcome, everyone. Yeah, you guys hear it too? Why is that happening? Packet loss? No, it's nothing to do with packet loss. <laughs> this is an offline game. I'm doing all right, McSpay. How are you? What's up, Queen Ganyu? Snowboards? Jaden, hello? Keep doing these Elden Ring streams so I can play Elden Ring with you. Uh, man, I, I play more than Elden Ring. You know this. We literally have Legend of Zelda coming out later tonight. So we'll be playing that tomorrow. What's up, Spark? Enote Mock, hello. Struggling with evacuation? What's going on, Mix Bay? God, these audio skips are kind of annoying, though. Not sure why they're happening. Oh, that guy gave me his gauntlets. What a nice guy. What a nice guy. How's my neck? It is stiff, dude. It is stiff. Wildfires surrounding my area. It's kind of scary. Oh, man. I hope everything turns out all right. That is that is scary. I'm sorry. All you play is from software games at that point. That's cool. That's you. That's you. But that's not me. Go away, fireman. You know, this axe actually hits really well now. I like that. <laughs> it just adds up so much damage so quickly. I love this thing. I'm not sure what the audio skip is, guys. I'm not sure. Um, let me see if there's any loose cables. Give me like 30 seconds. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. There are no loose cables, so I don't know what the issue is here. 
I don't know. I do not know, but Bren, with the five gifted members to the community, thank you very much. I appreciate it, dude. Thank you. Thank you very, very much for the kindness, man. Thank you very much. Hope you're doing great today, Bren. Thank you for the generosity. I've played The Witcher 3 many a times. <laughs> cancelled, Screamer. Cancelled. Hey, Mark, what's up? Hey, could you, uh, could you not do that, bud? Just step into the light. Just, just step into the light here. There you go. Yeah. Very good, man. Very good. We like that. What's up, Bed? Captain LaFu as well. Hey, Marius. Thank you for joining us. Honestly, bro, you're probably my most watched channel right now, and I'm fully here for it. Thank you for being here for it, for my streams and stuff, Tyler. It means a lot, dude. Thank you very much. Yeah, I'm doing okay, Rocky. A little sore in the neck, but I'm doing all right. There's our giant seal, by the way. That's what I came here for. That's what I came here for. Very good. Okay, so I am, I will say I'm not noticing any skips in audio, so maybe there was a slightly loose cable. But when I wiggled them all around and saw if they were loose at all, there was no movement. So I'm hoping that, I'm just, I'm just hoping that it's fixed up now. You know, I'm just, I'm just hoping that it's fixed up and good to go now. I don't want to deal with that right now. There's nothing over this way. I'm not fighting these stupid things. Get out of here. Get out of here, men. No stabby, sir. No stabby. It just skipped when you said that? No, it did not. I would have noticed. I, I, have, a, I have a very open ear for it right now. You doing Tears of the Kingdom tomorrow, normal time? Indeed, Brandon. Indeed. I'll be here for it. The reviews around it are looking great, by the way. The lowest score I've seen is a 9 out of 10. So that's cool. That's cool. Well, I'll be fighting Melania tonight, Pibala. Yeah. I will be fighting Melania tonight. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I also need to make a quick visit over to the old round table hold. Didn't mean to do that.
I tried. <laughs> I tried. Tried to kill him with a fireball. It didn't work so well. And there's the triple slice. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. So you can't give me that attack. I'm going to parry that 10 out of 10 times. That lunge is their easiest move to counter. Hey, Scarecrow, what's up? What's going on, Winter? Welcome back as well. Hey, guys, thank you all for tuning in today. Come to hang out with me. Thank you for pressing the like button. Brent, thank you again for five gifted members. I really appreciate it, dude. Hope you're all doing great today. What's up, Majin Kai? Another great day for another stream. Hey, glad to have you here, man. Glad to have you here. This is where the ancient hero... Yeah, the ancient hero drip right there. Yep. It's actually a fun sword, too. Okay, I want burn o flame. That's what I want right there. So let's snag that up real fast. Let's take that one. Hey, Sebastian. Hey, Noah. I got a question. Small lands, if I remember correctly, you played it and I watched your premieres, but I was curious if you still recommend it. Um, I think it's a good game. Yeah. I, I, if you're looking for a fun survival game, yeah. I, I would say that'd be one of maybe three survival games I would recommend right now. If you're, if you're looking specifically for a survival game that is not based around guns, right? If you want something that's a little more fantasy, then I would say in the, in this order of what I would recommend to least recommend it, I would say Valheim, Grounded, Small Lands. Yeah. Oh, Bur Burn o Flame only takes one slot? I thought it was two slots. Shit, man. Shit, man. I thought that was, I thought that was two slaughter. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Interesting. You beat Garman first try? Nice. Very nice. Hey, Florin, how you doing? Now, this thing better take somber stones to level up. I guess it doesn't really matter. I could level it up either way. Uh, where is this guy? Oh, Dobby's in the way. Hey, bud. Hi, buddy. <laughs> Thank you, Doob. He's getting up all in the way here. Where the hell is this thing? There it is. It requires regular smithing stones. Okay, well, let's go buy a whole bunch of those guys then. Let's do it. You want Sekiro gameplay from Josh? Uh, MD, it's not going to happen, man. I just don't like the game much. It's a quality game, but it's not something that I can see myself ever playing again. I just don't find it fun enough to return to. It's just not something that uh, I vibe with very well. Oh, dude, there, there's that too. Let me grab that. I forgot that we could purchase it. What's up, Kim? How you doing? All right. So we have all the way up to there. Let me buy 10 of these. We don't need to buy any of those. We need to buy five of those. And 10 of these. But I only have enough for four. Hold on. Hold on a minute. Yeah, me too, Scooter. I'm looking forward to playing some Legend of Zelda. It's been a while. Kim, hope you're doing great. Welcome back, man. How many more do I need? I need six more. Okay. Played any of the Bioshocks? Yes, I played all of them and love them dearly. Specifically the first one the most. You're hyped for Tears of the Kingdom? Yeah, me too, man. Me too. 
Oh, no. I'm gonna get it all installed tonight and make sure, you know, it runs well and all that. Get it all prepped for stream. What am I doing? Oh, no. Okay, we can actually get that thing to plus 25. I know exactly where I need to go for it. I did not grab the thing all the way over here. So let's go do that. When did you decide you're going to go with the Josh feed as your channel name? Uh, way of the Lao, the best way to explain it is I am not creative when it comes to making names. And so I was, I was thinking, I was like, what is the most straightforward way that I can relay the purpose of my channel? I was like, okay, my name is Josh, so let's incorporate that. I am indeed Josh. Second, it is going to be a video feed of content from Josh. So I was, I just kind of like took those keywords and slapped them all together. It is the feed of Josh's content the video feed of Josh's content, the Josh feed. And there we are. I know, creative process. Very creative process. <laughs> but damn it, it worked. <laughs> but yeah, I'm not creative when it comes to naming myself at all. Uh, uh, what I what I did previously, actually, when I was, when I was streaming over on Twitch, my name was Necro. And before the, ne the name Necro became available to me, I, uh, I was named Necrosaurus Rex. And the reason I came up with that name and Necro in general is because I played a lot of things like Diablo, D&D, &D, and other D&D &D related things, and uh, Guild Wars. And with all these games, I almost always started off as Necromancer. That was like the first thing I went for. And I was like, okay, well, the name Necro on Twitch is not available. So what can I do to include necro in my name because that's just what i've always gone by and go with something cool and i was like you know what would be really cool is an undead tyrannosaurus rex necrosaurus rex that was literally it that's the process i know very creative What's up, Degree? How you doing? So yeah, my creative process is just like, it's taking keywords that I have interest in for whatever various reasons whether it's my my actual birth given name as in Josh or if it's just a name that I've always gone by because that's the class that I've always played as in a lot of games. <laughs> that's pretty much it. That's my creative process with naming. And you've completely abandoned Twitch. I don't blame you. Yeah, uh, Twitch is on the out, man. Don't tell anyone, but I <laughs> I believe Twitch is really on the out. I, I don't see Twitch around in five years. I don't see them around as a company any longer in five years from now. I hope I'm wrong because I know a lot of people stream on Twitch and enjoy the website, but the way things are going there, it's not going to get better for a while. Okay, uh, we got that. Let's go get this seal to plus 25. What's up, Broku? How you doing, man? Probably won't see you playing Call of Duty anytime soon. Uh, if you're talking like multiplayer, no. No, you will not see me playing that. Put that there. Put this here. Take all these off. Let me put on like something here. Something, something with a lot of poise to it. Just get that extra poise going, you know? Actually, we might be able to change our greaves as well. 
Yeah. Get some high poise going so that way we can actually like not get staggered so easily. Okay, I think we're good to go now, guys. We can we should be able to do some pretty good damage with our fire stuff now. Should. Now let's get back on track. Where did we leave off? I defeated Malekith. And so we went back to the Ashen Capital, right? Yep. And so now we need to make our way over to the Hay League tree. So let's go here. I'm happy you stream on YouTube. I would have never found you on Twitch. Yeah, the majority of people here now would not have found me on Twitch. A lot of people don't go on Twitch from here. Okay. Is that your favorite monk build? What do you mean, Steam? All right. <laughs> yeah, Broku, yeah, I beat the game a lot. Uh, Sark, it's just a faith-based playthrough, man. Gave up on Twitch when it gave you four ads in a row. Yeah, their, their ad policy is pretty egregious now. Though I'm not saying YouTube is innocent when it comes to ads either. They're definitely, uh, they can push uh, a large amount of ads in a short amount of time. But, yeah, I, you know, I struggle with it because I would rather... I would rather have Google pay me directly. And so when you watch ads on my channels, it allows them to pay me directly, you know? So, you know, it's a back and forth. I try to, I try to create a good balance between the two. I try. I specifically make it so there's no more than one ad every 10 minutes on my content. No more than that ever. I don't know why I go out of my way to grab the Silver Scarab when I know I'm not going to use it. I don't know why. Because I'm a loot goblin. You know what? Fair. That is fair. He's about to fight Nile. Is he hard? He can be. He certainly can be. Thank you for 100 likes on the video, guys. I really appreciate you all supporting my content in that way. tried to parry me. Oh, I'm out of juice. I'm out of the juice. Hey, Marcelo, thank you for joining us. Hello there. That job's done. Job's done. All right, on to consecrated snowfield things. I'm probably going to fight at least a few of the bosses here. It is I. It is I. Or Tanya. I don't know why I say that every time, too. But um, a lot of the bosses here give really great amounts of runes, and I'll be damned if I'll pass that up right now. Stretch 
I'll be damned. I'll be damned. Hey, Clyde, how you doing? So let's go north and grab the map first. You know what's really cool, guys? You know, you know what, you know what I love about streaming? You know what I love? This might sound this might sound a little cheesy, a little corny, but you know what? Right now, for the next few hours, it's you, me, and video games. That's freaking cool, man. I don't know. I, I just think that's so great. You, me, and video games. You dig? You dig? Love that. Love, love, love that. The older I get, the more I enjoy in that company. Same here, man. Same here. Dustin, I'm really sorry to hear that, bud. I'm terribly sorry. Much love to you, dude. Right now, it's me and this vanilla gelato. Hey, enjoy your gelato, dude. I'm sorry, Dustin. Girth, if I didn't say hello to you, hello there, my guy. Hello there. You know, it's actually kind of weird to me to be wielding this tiny ass buckler with this big old axe. That's weird to me. I like it. Building my Valheim castle on second screen, very relaxing. Yeah, the building in Valheim is great, man. I spent many hours doing that. Hey, damn squib, how you doing? Where is Anastasia? Oh, Anastasia's not gonna appear here because I didn't kill her over in the other area. Oh no, she is, okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Cool. Time for fire. This axe does not mess around, dude. <laughs> this axe is amazing. I need to respec my flasks again, though. I need to do that. Nice, lethal. Have a good time with it, man. Does this shield make my axe look small? Minecraft is the best building. I would say Minecraft has the most freeform building, but I think uh, I think Valheim's is better. I, I think having a little bit more structure around like the beams and everything is a much cooler process. That's just my personal take though. As far as Terraria goes, I don't really like that game much, so I've never built in it, so I can't comment on that one. If you like it though, that's cool, man. That's the purpose of video games, is to have a good time with them. If that's what you like, then do it up, baby. Hell yeah. I wonder, can you poison great worms? Nope. Or, well, <laughs> not any faster than you can die to their magma. But you can poison them. Look at that. He actually got poisoned very easily. It only took a couple seconds. This is another randomizer playthrough? No. It's just a casual, normal playthrough with a bit of a faith build. Just killing time until Legend of Zelda comes out, which we'll be playing tomorrow at 4 p.m. Eastern Time, guys. It'd be great to have you here for it. I never played Raft. I've heard good things about it, though. 
Ever tried the winning game known as EVE Online? Long time ago. Long, long, long time ago. Didn't play it very long, though. I saw how heavily monetized the system was, and I just kind of backed out of it. I thought this was a fire build. I mean, I am largely using fire. I have burn -O flame, catch flame. I have flame grant me strength. Uh, the black flame. I've got lots of flame stuff, dude. Hey, Walter, thank you for joining us from Brazil. So a really cool no dodge playthrough. Yeah, that, that I don't know. I like dodging though. I understand why people do that, but man, that just sounds anti-fun to me. That actually hit me. Okay. All right. I was hoping he would not do that one. Whatever, going for it. Oh, nice. Well done, sir. Good job. Tentacle man, time to go. Oh, that still hit me. Gross. I'm out of juice. I don't have the juice, man. Yeah, I couldn't not do that because all those runes, you see? All those runes. I just realized as well, I didn't plus 10 my... my Black Axe. I should do that really fast. Hey, Hitman. How you doing? The monetization. I should have known Josh is not an enjoyer. Your principles are valid. I, uh, you know, I don't mind monetization in a sense where it allows people to buy like skins and stuff. But when it comes to actual stats that are involved, that gets a little annoying. I don't mind from a cosmetic standpoint though. Anyone play Apple Spore back in the day? Oh yeah. I remember, I remember the day that Robin Williams did the presentation for the first Spore. You remember that guys? Were you there? Were you there for the day that Robin Williams presented Spore? I watched that many times over. That was so cool, dude. That was so damn cool. I really want to go back to the round table. Oh, thank you. Am I close to Melania? Yeah, we're in Consecrated Snowfield. Won't work on your new computer though yeah has a lot of compatibility issues unfortunately yep thank you samurai for the reminder on the flasks let's 
get at least three going for now. Alright, let's see. I want to go do this one. Yeah, Kyle, yeah. That's why, that's why I just kind of wasn't interested in staying around with it, which, you know, I don't blame people for playing the game because I know it has, like, don't get me wrong, I mean, it interests me as well, you know? I just don't do the, the monetized stats thing, personally. I'm actually rather okay with that type of game existing, though, as long as companies know that it's going to do certain things reputation-wise to them if they don't do it right then you know that's on them to to deal with you know don't mind it existing uh, i just i do not partake i mean even for games that i really enjoyed like genshin impact that uh, started throwing monetization at me in a hard way i would rather not play a game that i really enjoy the gameplay of than pay money I don't mind buying a license to play the game. Like, give me a $60, $70 license to pay to play the game as much as I want. Fine, I'm there. I do not mind buying games that, you know, I enjoy. But do not nickel and dime me. That's where I draw the line. Oh no! That sucked, man. Ah. Uh. Brother. Let me live, bro. Alright, saved. Saved, saved, saved. That's a good amount of runes right there, too. 93k, we'll take it. Punk Metal Tau, thank you for the five bones. Were you there when Abe Lincoln presented a video game four, four, and seven years ago? <laughs> four, four, huh? You know, when I first read that, I thought you were going the four spoken route. Four spoken. Thank you very much for the uh, five bones, man. I appreciate it. Thank you. Alan, this is Consecrated Snowfield. crabs yeah this is a place of magic and wonder it's known as the josh feed <laughs> what's up wizzy hey aaron welcome back hope you're doing great all right let me take a look at the map here we need to go i think it's like right there if i remember right game hollow knight yeah it's a metroidvania souls like yeah i've played it a little bit just never did a full playthrough it's not that one. Is it here? Just around the, the bend here then?
No. Not here either. I think I've gone too far. We must go the other way. Have you ever played Hades? Nope. Not yet, anyway. Bonk. I know it's up on this wall somewhere, so we just need to follow it and we'll find it. And I'm in combat. Wait, was that the door right there? No. If I were a door to a catacombs, where would I be? No, it's, it's got to be. It's got to be here. It has to be. It must be. There it is. I'm doing okay, Andrew. How are you? What's up, Sneaky? Upgraded Axel plus 10. I believe so. Yes. I should spend these runes. Yeah, just in time to hear the Doug theme. Thank you guys for 150 likes on the video, by the way. I appreciate it. Guys, let's, let's do a thing. Let's try to get 300 before the first hour of stream. It's currently 443. Can we get to 300 in the next 15, 17 minutes? If you haven't hit the like button yet, it would mean a lot if you would do that for me. Well, the reason I ask is just because it, uh, it helps YouTube recommend my content to more people. It goes a long way. Hey, Akiha, how you doing? Done and done. Appreciate it, dude. There's nothing up there for me. I just wanted to knock that down in case I die and need to come back through. I hit the like button and immediately received a check for $1,000. Local banks hate me. <laughs> Okay, that always happens faster than I think it's going to. Like, I know it's there, but that attack happens so damn fast. I I think I'm ready, and then I'm not ready. You know what I mean? I also don't need to be in this room here. What's up, Cupid? Hope you're doing well. Yeah, Thomas, I'm on PC. Ah. What the hell just hit me? Oh, dude, I hate these things so much. The fact that it will not let me roll onto it smoothly. Very annoying. This isn't Josh's third birthday this year. He thanks you all for the happy wishes. Yeah, I don't know what it is, but I've got some type of issue where I just keep having birthdays every day. Okay. 
Okay. You know, I should have just rolled forward through it. God damn it, dude. <laughs> He's cursed with birthdays. Okay, it actually worked that time. You're like 3,000 years old now. You got to get that checked up. Eh. I think we're all right, dude. I think we'll be all right. Age is but a number, right? Not representative of how we feel. <laughs> Don't mind me as my body is actively decaying from the inside out. Okay. What's the, uh, Scarecrow? Uh. Okay. We got that. Let's go over to this dungeon now, shall we? Does Flame grant me strength, just power within? Pretty much, yeah. Pretty much. Why this boss wasn't the beginning of the game. If you don't know how to fight those guys, they can be tough. That's the thing. Like, sure, a lot of people go up and beat them into the dirt now easily. But when they first got started with that with the game, the very earliest, like, Grave Warden Duelist was kicking people's asses like crazy. Well, the reason I know that is because I put out a guide on it and it got many thousands of views. Many people were struggling with it when, game, when the game first came out. they used in much more horrid context that threw me off a bit i mean you shouldn't connect basic language to other horrid contexts for the sake of wanting to point that out that's a bit not okay shouldn't correlate bad events with decent people big brag yes big brag Hey, Sean, how you doing, man? <laughs> yeah, Andrea, that, that, that's the beauty of ga uh, a game like this that has so much, uh, so many different areas that, uh, you know, a lot of people will explore the game a lot, but they'll never see the full extent of it their first playthrough. It's just the nature of it, you know? It's pretty cool. Oh. Oh, oh, there you go. Hello. 
Hello, friends. Hello there. Hello there. Can I get a haircut? Uh, no, I put on a mask. And a wig. Yeah. What's up, Matt? How's it going? I'm doing okay, Gabriel. Welcome back. How are you? Yeah, that's a pretty good fire spell. Yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> I like it, man. I like it. All right. What's up, Hydra? Been a while. How you doing? Captain Trips, good to have you back. Hello? Thank you all for tuning in. They're pressing the like button. Guys, we are 89 likes away from 300 on the video. If you haven't pressed the like button yet, it would mean a lot to me if you would. I appreciate it, folks. Any likers that have not liked yet? Oh, absolutely crushed. I never see you use buffs. It's cool to see you do it. Yeah, it's not something I do very often at all. A lot of my playthroughs are pretty bare bones. Streamers cheating? I guess so. Oh, pain. Warcry ran out already? Weird. Meteorite of Astel. And them runes. Nice, dude. Nice. Hey, Mike, how you doing? Isaac, good to see you. Find out why I don't get to watch most of your live streams. I'm usually at work. I'm on break right now. Understandable, man. I do go live at 4 p.m. Eastern time. A lot of people in the U.S. are still at work, if not leaving work soon, unless you work second shift, of course, in which case you're probably just getting into work now or halfway through your shift. And, uh, you know, it's late over in the European hours, but it's just... Uh, it's generally the late afternoon, early evening hours when my brain actually starts kicking into high gear. Yeah, earlier in the day, my brain just doesn't do it, man. 
It's always been this way. And so I just lean into what my body gives me. I, I use I use my brain's advantages at the time, and that's why I go live when I do. I'm a very sluggish person earlier in the day, but later on in the evening, in the middle of the night, I'm very active. I would say near hyperactive. And so that's why I, you know, I do things the hours that I do. Hey, Elvis, thanks for joining us. All right, I think if I put on this torch, it's going to make me heavy load. Yes. Oh, I'm still heavy load with that. All right, the mask must come off. The mask must go. It is time for the return of Not Rick. That's my name, by the way. Not Rick. As you can see in the top left corner. Not Rick. Sad face. Hey, Crashy, how you doing? What's up, Retro? Nightfolk? Yes, well, I am Nightfolk. Nightfolk indeed. Oh, that puts me over heavy? Okay, sad. I love that so much. The fact that the charge pushes them back is so good. <laughs> yes, find the albinoric woman. Any relation between not Rick and LaCringe? I must know the lore, to be honest. No, I just made a character that's really sad that they're not Soldier of God, Rick, from the beginning of the game. He is the toughest boss in the whole game, and my character aspires to be them. And so they're really sad that they're not them at this point in time, but hopefully one day they get to embody them. And now that I really say that out loud, that sounds something borderline serial killerish mindset, so huh. Take that as you will. In <laughs> borderline question mark? <laughs> Hey, what's up, Poseidon? I was struggling with the fire giant that I saw your video on how to beat it and help. Thank you so... Hey, that, that's great, dude. I'm glad that my video could help you. I find fire giant to be one of the easier bosses in the game, but I know that a lot of people struggle with it. So I figured that the strat that, uh, you know, that I use might be helpful to others and wanted to share that. I'm glad that it worked out for you. That's great news. And thanks for tuning into the live stream. I appreciate it. Okay, guys, listen, 59 likes, 59 likes away from 300. Any likers in the chat? Anyone, anyone not press the like button on the video yet? Would mean a lot if you would. I'm trying to get to 300 in the first hour. Now's our time to shine. Now's our time. I didn't get the very first one. I actually skipped over it. Let me go rectify that. Struggling with Malaketh. I do have a video on that, Gabriel, if you'd like to check it out. It's on my channel. Okay, there it is. A seal was broken. A seal was broken. Uh, you did kill them and are attempting to take their identity? Shh. Where is my hat? There it is. There's my hat. All right, let's get over to the hay league tree. A 
let's a go, as my good friend Mario says. All right, guys, we'll take a really fast break. I have to pee. I drank too much water. I'll be right back in just a minute. If you haven't pressed the like button yet, we're 35 away. Just 35. I'll be right back, dudes. All right, guys, we're back. Thank you for chilling and waiting. Let's uh, turn on our nightlight here and let's make our way to Melania, shall we? Oh, guys, I don't know how many of you guys uh, care about this type of stuff, but I found out today that the same company that made Armored Core models previously, Kotobukiya, they're actually signed up to do more for Armored Core 6. Yeah. So, I, you know, I, um, <laughs> I might have to get some of those when they release. There's not a lot of details around it yet other than that, that it's happening. It's the same company that made a whole bunch of Armored Core models previously. So I'm very excited. Because they're, I don't know if you guys have ever seen any of their older ones, but they're very cool. I actually had a bunch of them at one point. I had a, a whole bunch of them, but you know, as I explained before, I had to sell a bunch of them off to make ends meet a long time ago. So I'm actually really excited about this. I'm actually really excited. The same company, yeah, Kotobukiya. Very, very excited for this. You made my Alexa turn on the living room lights. Alexa, sing Despacito, or play Despacito. Remember that meme? What's up, Shark? How have you been, man? Good to see you here today. What type of run are we doing? It's just a, a, a casual faith-based playthrough. Using a weapon I've never used before and just some incantations along the way. Mostly fire stuff. Or my conversation in mod chat when, <laughs> when you get them figurines. <laughs> okay. Alexa, follow the Josh feed on YouTube. Alexa, buy Josh green tea. What does Scarlet Rot taste like? Feet. It tastes like... It tastes like rotten feet. You know how... You know how I know that? Because every time I fight Melania, she kicks me, dude. I'll go to fight her and she just does like a spin kick move. 
What the hell is even that? What the hell, man? Yeah, you guys thought it was going to be something sexual, didn't you? Didn't you, you freaking pervs? Yeah, I see you. I see you. Yeah. Can't have Josh seeming all innocent over here. Got to got to got to perv it out. <laughs> Yo, Matt, thank you for the Juice Crew plus one. Thank you for the gifted membership. Who'd that go out to? Went out to Stan, man. Thank you very much, man. Thank you. I appreciate it. Us pervs? Yeah, right? No way. Okay, I need Flame to grant me strength in this moment. And we go. Might be better to not war cry for this. Ouch. Yeah, my mistake here was doing uh doing a war cry. Okay. Hell yeah, Ryan. I'll be glad to have you here for it, dude. What's up, Just James? How have you been, man? All right, strength is a big old 60 now. That's good. One of the easiest moves to dodge for you. Oh, uh, Loretta's Scythe there. What's it called? Loretta Slash? Yeah. I don't find it difficult to dodge either. Most of it's just positioning. You can actually dodge all of it without actually dodging if you just position yourself well. Just get yourself on the opposite side of it. The actual hitbox of the horse will make it so your character moves out of the way of it so it can't hit you. Not sure why I came up here to grab this. I don't need it, but whatever. Just nine likes away from the big 300, guys. Nine likes away. We're almost there. That would be cool, Cossum. Yeah, I think if they're riding a horse, maybe they should have a second phase where they're knocked off the horse. I mostly say that because I think it would be really cool to kind of have like one-on-one -on -one combat with the tree sentinels, both draconic and non-draconic, as well as like Loretta. Yeah, the axe doesn't care about your tiny shield, buddy. I'm sorry. 
When Zelda's out, you're going to live stream it? Yes, I'll be live streaming it tomorrow, Retro Nerd. Tomorrow. Hey, there it is. 302 likes. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much. Thank you very, very much. Dude, the axe just squishes things, dude. Love doing that. Hi, guys. Just passing by. Don't mind me. I have a Melania to fight. You understand? That guy just threw up. Is he okay? Didn't dodge soon enough. Sedge. Fight the three revenants at the same time? No, I like staying alive, man. I'll tell you what. You go fight three revenants at the same time, okay? That You, you can have your fun with that. I'll have my fun not doing that. Hell yeah. No, he's not. Thanks for asking. He's been needing to talk. <laughs> hey, Aaron. How you doing? What's up, Vid? I always ask what he's doing, not how he's doing. <laughs> You hate the revenants in the ditch? You know what's great about that, Matt? Is they share the same sentiment. <laughs> you know, it's like, you know, we all hate them, but the good, great news about this is, is they hate us just as much. Hey, Muddy, how you doing? Can I ask you a question? Wait, I already did. Yes. Yes, you did indeed. Pardon me, sir. Passing by. Passing through. Making my way downtown. Now, please stop smacking me. I'm just going for a walk backwards through the Lake of Rot. Or a Lake of Rot, not the Lake of Rots. Hello, Jacqueline. No! Kwai Dang, thanks for joining us. Hope you're doing great. Love when you say do anything right for you. I respect that. Yeah, man. Every person is different. Everyone has different hobbies, different enjoyment around different ideas. You know, if you're doing what's right for you, then, you know, you're having your own fun and that's great. That's what it's all about, man. That was a bad omen for the fight ahead. Are you saying Melania is going to push me off a tree root? 9.8 meters per second. Yes, my arch enemy made another appearance, guys. They sure did. I think I see Melania. Yeah, you can see Melania's boss room from up here, all the way down there. Indeed. Oh, I thought I just did it again. Holy. It's good to have you back, James. What have you been up to, man? Totally lost with my samurai and where to go after killing the fire giants. Have you gone up to the giant, uh, the cauldron up there? If you go all the way in there, uh, I'm not going to tell you much more than this in case, you know, I don't want to spoil anything for you, but if you truly are lost, then hear me out. The next story related thing to do and cover your ears if you do not want to know, cover your ears in three, two, one. Okay. In case you do want to know, 
uh, what you need to do is go up to the cauldron, ride, ride your horse up the chain onto the side of the cauldron, go to the opposite end, sit at the site of Grace, and then you'll see an option that says talk to Melina. Do that, and you'll see where to go next. What's up, Aorus? Hey, Jetpack Laser Penis. Hell of a name, brother. guy who wrote this hokey pokey had a crazy funeral he kept falling out of the casket he put they put the right foot in that's where the trouble started uh, damn it man Okay, I don't know how much I'm going to struggle with this. I don't know if I'm going to struggle with it at all. Let's see what happens here, guys. Me versus Melania with this axe. Let's see how this goes. Let us see how this goes, okay? In fact, let me... You know what? No, this is fine. This is fine. Let's just... We're going in. I rolled too early. Shit. Mm, okay. Well, I'm dead. Just kidding, I lived, bitch. Okay, a bad parry attempt. Oh, God, I'm dead. All right, there it goes. Yo, Carmen, thank you for the five bones. Yay, work concluded. Time to watch the Josh. Let's go. Right on time for Melania, Carmen. Thanks for joining us, dude, and thank you for the five. Thank you for the five. All right, I'm definitely putting the buckler away. I do not want to parry this fight. I don't. I don't want to do it. I'm, I don't. It's, a, it's just a faith build, Joe. We're killing time until Legend of Zelda comes out tomorrow. Oh, that missed. What a tragedy, to be honest. That should make you waterfall, right? Ay, uh...
That was some excellent trading. Oh my God. Ooh wee. Ow. Oh my God, we did it again. Simon, I'll be playing Tears of the Kingdom on stream tomorrow. That's been the plan. Yep. God, I just dumpstered her. Uncle Roger. Are you talking about the, uh, the YouTuber? Uncle Roger. I love that guy. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, yo <laughs> I love that guy so much he's hilarious Yes, Marais, Scooter. Marais, Marais, however you pronounce it. Yeah. True horror. I got the foot. Damn. Oh, I don't like that. I'm dead. I was in a very bad position for that one. Very bad position for that. I knew that was bad as soon as I saw the animation. Yikes. Let me just take this off completely. There we go. I'm on controller, lad. I like your views on KFC as a meal and how it changed your life. Um, let me start with saying I don't eat KFC. KFC makes me absolutely sick to my stomach anymore, so I don't eat it. Does that help?
I'm doing alright, Damon. How are you, man? Alright, that should be Waterfowl right there. I enjoy fried chicken and all the things that can go with it, but I do not like KFC. I used to. I used to enjoy KFC quite a bit. Now it just hurts. Oh no, that missed! Hello. Popeyes, I've actually never had it. Phase one millennia with this axe is easy as hell, actually. Kind of crazy. Uh oh. Ha, we're fine. Okay, maybe not. Maybe we're not fine. Okay, now we're fine. Oof. No slicing! Already with this? Okay, all right, I guess. All right, all right, all right. I missed. Oh! I missed. I think it was my knockdown moment too. Oh well, what can you do? What can you do except throw some fireballs? We try something. Oh nice, that works really well. Sick. That just did so much damage to her. Hey, where's my second uh, or my third uh, bloom here? Give me the bloom. There it is. Not the right bloom. Not what I asked for. That's not what I asked for, Melania. Give to me the Scarlet Aeonia. That's not it either. Maybe if I ask nicely, please, mommy, may I have one Aeonia? Please, mommy, Aeonia me. No? That's not... I guess she's skipping it this time. Okay. I guess she's not going to do it. Strength. Bye. <laughs> it 
innocence lost. There's 25% player size mod that's basically I'm Elden Feats. Uh, it's not a public mod. It's not for public use. It's not on Nexus or anything like that. At least it wasn't as of yesterday. Okay. That is Melania down. What was that? Was that our third attempt? That's not bad. She's just, she's just really weak to fire, guys. Like, that's what it comes down to. Especially when you use things that can throw her into the air like I did. Like that, that, not only does it throw her in the air, but you can get hit by several of the spires. When she gets hit, it doesn't make her have iframes. So she just takes all the damage. It just really simplifies the fight. Burno Flame is very effective against her. Yo, Gara, thank you for five gifted memberships to the community. Big. And King Smithers with the 199 pounds also big thank you very much guys i appreciate it thank you very very much uh this might be zero runes but let me grab it anyway okay let's go fight mr moog shall we Mowgli, lord of blood moog Yeah, fire just, uh, fire counters her really hard. But when you do some type of spell that actually throws her into the air and does not give her any iframes, like Burno Flame, it just dominates her. Especially if you, like, when you learn the casting time of it to where she can walk into it and then just go flying. If you do it right and you have a large mana pool, you can actually repeat cast it over and over. Eventually, she will do something like, like Waterfowl or something like that to where she just kind of flies away out of it and starts... You know hitting you like crazy but up until that time it's highly effective it's moging time i have come to report that i've successfully chatted in your stream have you chatted successfully in your successful successfully in your stream today john um yeah i sure have i sure have dude mm-hmm I sure have, bud. This axe is also extremely good. I don't know. I don't know if this axe was buffed at some point, but I'm finding this axe to be extremely strong. I've never used it until until yesterday and today. And it is it dominates in combat, dude. It really does. No offense, Josh, but you kind of sound like a bottom when you called Melania mommy. I'm glad you got the joke, Gerald. I, I'm glad you understood what I was going for. Yes. Very good. <laughs> that is the intention, yes. <laughs> what axe is it? It is Gargoyle's Black Axe. You get it from the... Uh, the gargoyle kindred guy in front of the rolled lift the one that drops down right here you defeat it and it gives you this axe and the twin blade axe's colossal weapons got buffed all around better recovery frames and more lunge on attacks yeah it's working out for him man it's working out Yeah, it's a bit of a meme. When I when I call when I call Melania or any other woman mommy, it's meant to make me sound like a bottom. That's that's 
That's my joke. No offense taken. That's what I was going for. Okay. Let's get in here. Is there anything here that I need? I don't think so. I mean, there is an incantation. The blood flies thing. But I don't care about that. I don't need any of the stones. I don't need the bleed mask. I don't need the golden seeds. I just don't need anything. I think we're good to go. Hey, Calred. Hey, Jojo. How's it going, dudes? More blood tax? Yeah, screw blood tax, to be honest. I'm going to see if I can poison Moog. I should be able to. Oh, I just realized I don't have the purifying crystal. Wait a minute. All right, let's go get a, uh, a Sight of Grace. I don't want to do this without the purifying crystal. I need to go grab that really quickly. Scarlet Rod on Moog is so strong. I can't remember if I've ever done that or not. I, it, the only enemies that I know for sure that I can think of that I've used Scarlet Rod on in the past, and my incantation only build specifically, was Radon, Fire Giants, and um, Radagon. I don't remember if I did it to Moog or not. I might have. But I just don't recall. Let, let me just go all the way up here to get the one up here, and then we can go fight Eleanor real quickly, and then uh, grab the purifying crystal. I forgot to grab that earlier in the game. Used Lion's Claw and Exile's Decay. He didn't hit second phase. Yeah, that sounds like it would be, work pretty well. I think you did it with the Dragon Incantation Warrior. Yeah, I very well may have because I used incant. You know, the the Dragon Communion stuff there. That was part of that build too. Yeah. I know a lot of people look down on the Dragon Communion stuff, but man, it is just there's something so badass about that, dude something so badass about just like you know using like dragon's claw or like having a dragon's head appear above your body and just spew fire or scarlet rot everywhere or even the frostbite one is good you know something so cool about that to me those spells are so fun i've already got the sacred tear from that spot yeah It was a fun playthrough. It really was. It was a good time. I don't know. I I will admit that I usually default to magic in a lot of games, but it, it's never been a thing with From Software games that I enjoyed using magic much up until Elden Ring. Elden Ring has kind of put a spotlight on magic in a way that makes them a lot more interesting in there in this universe, you know. Anyway, let's go fights. What's her face? Right there. You really got a unique voice? Thank you, ma'am. Why, thank you. Dex, Int, or Strength, Faith? If I had to choose, I would go Strength, Faith. That's what I am now. I like Strength, Faith. I like Faith more than Intelligence. For the most part. Uh, yeah, as far as, like, interest in the spells. I just find them a little more interesting. I went too far. So 
saw a comic of Renala and Marika being in a relationship. Any of that true? Uh, not specifically Marika, but Radagon. And if you know the lore of the game, Radagon, <laughs> Radagon, Radagon and Marika actually share one body. So kind of. Not that Renala knew that, but kind of. What's my favorite area? I enjoy Kaelid and Faramazula. This where I want to be? I think this is where I want to be. What's been your favorite build so far? Uh, this is not where I want to be. Favorite build so far is my Black Flame Monk. Any moggers in the chat? Any any moggers? Hi Josh, although I hate Souls games, I enjoy watching you go through them. Hey, I'm glad to have you here for it, Dan. Nice dodge. I didn't have time to do it because I got hit by that little uh, the swing he does after he says uh, duo or I'm sorry Unis. And so I didn't have time to actually pop the heel. <laughs> I didn't have time. This game is confusing. It has so many confusing bosses. You have Moog, Morgo, Mor Margit, Megan. I cannot understand it. It is not 100 years of Solitudes. <laughs> There's a lot of M's involved. Yeah. There are, there are a lot of M's, dude. Some people just don't like the, the gameplay, Calrid. That's just, that's, you know, just how it is. It's just how it is for some. <laughs> Worth it.
Uh, I dodged a little early there. Uh oh. Uh oh. What I wanted to do there was actually dodge under the stick as he swung it, but it didn't work out how it imagined in my mind because I moved to the left instead of to the right. If I had moved to my right, it might have worked out. All the same, it didn't. We died. GG. Oh! Step into the cloud, man. Uh-oh. Hey, man, can you stop? Can you stop that? Thanks. Ah, stop pulling blood out of the sky, man. Stop it. I'm not getting very much damage in here. Off. Off. I'm in a lot of pain. Oh shit, I never did the thing! It's fine, guys. It's fine. Don't even worry about it. <sighs> yeah, man, just spray that fire everywhere. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. It's mine. All right, it's official, guys. I have struggled more with Moog today than I did Melania. I struggled more with Moog than Melania today. Huh. That's a thing that's going on in my life. Look at that. You guys see how it says on the left side of the screen? No skill. Exactly. It's exactly that. Oof. Oof. What's going on here? Why aren't you poisoned?
bitch. I love these wings that he grows, man. They're so badass. Bye. I can see it as clear as day. The coming of Mogwin. Hold on, he's gonna say it. There it is. Mogwin. All times I fought Mog, I've never broken his stance. He's actually not bad to you just need to bring in a heavier weapon because he is larger as long as you keep hitting r2s whether it's jumping r2s charged r2s just keep landing those r2 attacks they actually break down in a matter of like five six hits i did it what two times that fight the secret to doing it specifically in the second phase because he jumps around so much what you want to do is right after the end of the curse happens basically right after the third time he heals you can get two free charged R2s on him. And then he's going to quickly jump away, throw blood at you. And then almost every time he throws blood at you, he'll come diving in. So that what I do is I move to my left when he's doing that and then dodge. And then I'll keep moving to my left as he's doing the upswing and then comes in for the crash after that. Usually by that time, if you roll it right, you can end up behind him, which allows you to get another free charged R2 on him. So that's three out of the five or six needed right away. That strategy has always worked for me against him as far as staggering him in the second phase. Ren, thank you for the five bones, man. You think Slayer are Moog fans since it's always raining blood at his house? <laughs> Good tune, man. Good tune. I like it. I like it very much. Thank you for the fiber. I appreciate it, dude. Hey, Kevin. Hey, Mark. Menacing Hammer. Thank you for two months of membership as well. Josh, you just got mogged. I did. I got mogged, what, three, four times there? Feels bad, dude. Feels bad. You hate to see it. Happens to the best of us, though. It's all right. Hey, does anyone know if Gideon can be poisoned? What's up, Feels? Sir Gideon Offnir, the all spamming. Now, see, the thing is, I will only be able to poison him freely once so i have to make this succeed right away but luckily i have my no skill on my side so to stand before the elven it's you to become elven lord what a sad state of affairs I can no he can be poisoned nice shall take the throne queen america has high hopes for us but we will continue to struggle on to Hey, can you stop that? <laughs> I just kept walking at him. I didn't let him cast. It worked. Whenever, I, whenever Jush takes on Sir Gideon, I think of the Spongebob episode. How many times do we have to teach you this lesson, old man? Oh, 
Yeah, so the secret is, as long as you have a weapon heavy enough to stagger him out of his spellcasting animations, then you can just keep walking at him and just keep one, L or I'm sorry, r one him over and over. That's it. That's pretty much it. This axe is great, by the way. I'm loving this thing. Dat axe, though. Dat axe. All right, um... You know, just to kind of... Let me see. Let's, let's look around. Let's look around. What bosses do we have quick access to that we've not killed yet? Let's go to the Divine Tower of Kaelid. That's a pretty tough boss fight. You answered all the questions Gideon axed. True. Blessed Usax, he died last night. All the bosses in Far Missoula are dead. Well, I think it's great that I can now recommend axes to people because axe, like this axe doesn't even have a whole lot of special stuff going on for it. But it's still highly effective. And that feels great because when this game first came out, axes were trash. When this game first released, axes were god awful. If you were using an axe, you were putting yourself at a major disadvantage. Can you please room farm for, for six hours? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why would I do this? We finished everything underground. I was, I was streaming when working for a few days earlier this week. I did not do anything underground this playthrough at all. I didn't go underground whatsoever. I completely avoided it this time. Beat any of the Astles? We beat uh, the one in Consecrated Snowfield earlier today. You guys want me to go kill some underground bosses after this I and mean, we have we have uh, a whole lot of time to kill tonight it's only 6 p.m i have at least a couple hours to kill so if you guys want to go see me slaughter some underground bosses i can do that granted they will die quick because i'm very over leveled for it at this point but Made that climb look easy yeah i don't find the uh the platforming here too difficult i always go grab this door just in case though because you know gravity is a gravity is a mean mean bitch hey paul thank you for the five bones my constant need to share the glory that is rice pudding is costing me money all hail rice pudding look at this guy lobbying absolutely lobbying for rice pudding you guys see this big rice has big rice pudding has paid off paul Big rice pudding. How much are they paying you, Paul? How much are they paying you, dude? <laughs> Thank you for the five again, man. I appreciate it. It's very kind. A rune arc. Yo, Kasim gifting a membership to Jojo Peril. Thank you very much for the gifted one, dude. Thank you very much. I 
I appreciate it. And Calred with seven months of membership, praise the rice for who else will eat that milky crap? Amen. <laughs> Thank you, Cal Calred. And Gerald with eight months, all hail rice pudding. We got some rice pudding enthusiasts around here. I don't know why I killed that guy when when I needed to sit at the side of grace, but whatever. Thank you, uh, Calred, Gerald, Kasim, Paul, and Mark D with five gifted memberships to the community as well. Big. Dude, seriously, thank you for the big generosity with the gifted members. It means a lot, man. Thank you very much. Well, I guess we're eating that one. Let's see if this hits somehow. It did, but it wasn't worth the damage. See, I need to heal, but I was going to input read. There we go. That works. Oh, get me out of there, man. Oof. Nice. Dun, 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 dun. Hey, can you stop smacking me? That'd be great, dude. Thanks. Dun, 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 dun. Oof. Anyway. Yo, Kasim, thank you for another month of membership. Me. Let Scarlet Mommy step on me. Me immediately after. Flame cleanse me. <laughs> Damn it, dude. What's up, Mythic Blue? How you doing? St. McKay, hello. Will you beat this on your first try? Yeah. Yeah, I will. Absolutely. Can you imagine Josh in a, in a fight IRL saying, can you stop smacking me? That would be great. <laughs> please, sir. Please consider no longer smacking me. That would be nice. Janet, they give the two bones. Horchata greater than rice pudding. Now, this might come off as blasphemous to some, but I've never had horchata. I've never had horchata. Now, I don't know if that means that I'm missing out. I'll never know. Or uh, I don't, I shouldn't say never. I don't know up to this point. How much vigor do I have? 40. So, Janet, while I cannot agree, because I do not know, I can say that I'm not a massive fan of rice pudding. So it's a big maybe. Thank you for the two. And Gera with the two as well. Apostle went down because he hates rice pudding. Oh, so that's why he died. Oh. Well, damn, it's so simple. Enjoy rice pudding. Stay alive. Nice. Comparing horchata to rice pudding, apples to oranges. Well, I mean, let me just say that I like, I like oranges a little bit more than apples, but I still like apples. But all the same, I compare them too. 
you know? It's milky sweet cinnamon. Same. I too am milky sweet cinnamon. Hey, Rodrigo with the two reels, two 220 reels, rather, sorry. Bacon greater than all. I do enjoy some bacon. I do enjoy me a little bit of bacon there, bud. I do. Oh, that guy just decided to uh, not be alive anymore. All right. See ya. See ya. Thank you for the 220 reels, Rodrigo. And Gera and Janet with the two bones as well. I appreciate it, guys. And Mark D with another gifted member going out to Beta. Thank you very much, Mark. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. I don't like that thing, but I can't break it, so. You're lucky. I'm doing all right, Subasa. How are you doing? Hello, friends. I'm just going to carry on, make my way downtown, as one does. Your last video was great. Thank you. I'm glad you enjoyed it. guys listen i have to go fight myself real quick give me a moment all right just give me a moment here captain trips with the five dollar super chest says number one hey thank you thank you very much i appreciate it a lot thank you I'm annoying. Oof. Thinks the enemy mimic can use flask, but the ashes cannot. Yeah, I don't know. I, uh, you know, it doesn't affect me at all because I don't use them. But I, I would think that they would, sh they should be able to as well because the idea is that it mimics you. But I know that they can mimic pr pretty much everything else, right? They can use all the spells. They can use like even items you have equipped, just not the flasks for some reason. I think the, I miss why the mimic didn't have an axe because I have the axe and the uh, seal on both of my uh, both on the right hand, so it had to make a choice, and it never pulled out the axe. A lot of the time, mimics will default to, to spamming spells than they will to going melee. <laughs> You're faster than you. True. I am faster than me.
But to my understanding, they get uh, they can use pretty much everything else, but they like everything else won't have like a limit to it, right? Like I think you can give them like pots, for example, and they can just keep throwing them a nonstop. Pro tip: unequip everything when facing mimic tier. Beat yourself up. Fist fight? Nah, that's lame. Try to actually improve what you can do and actually just fight it. There is no better way than to spot your own weaknesses in your build than trying to fight your build with your build and seeing what works and what doesn't. Spot your own weaknesses that way. As fit goes hard, I enjoy it too, Ant. Boop. I missed. Grabbed by the rats. I frames. Remember when you fought him on your Gideon run and the mimic pwned you a few times? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I had to fight Gideon three times over in a single playthrough, man. Elden Ring, your favorite of all time? It's definitely one of, uh, you know, one of my favorite games, but I, I wouldn't say favorite of all time. I'm a very mood-based gamer, and so because of that, my favorite can be different on any one day of the week. I know that's weird, but such is the way of it with me. Hmm. Regal Ancestor Spirit. Hello there. Let me see how the fire does against it. If I can get it to stand still long enough. <laughs> okay. Uh, the fire basically can insta-kill it if you do it right. Bye. Oh, it didn't get hit again. What areas that doesn't have rats? My live stream chat right now. No rats here. No rats here, bud. I have an exam tomorrow morning, so I'm going to go to bed now. Have a great night, Gossam. Best of luck on your exam, dude. Best of luck on your exam. Hope everyone has a good day or night and enjoy and then like the stream. Hey, I appreciate it, man. I appreciate it. Have a great night. There's a guy down here. 
Oh, that's not ideal. I'm dead. Bye. Oh my god. You guys hear that scream? What the hell, man? That was something. Oh, good thing we're already down here, though. Uh, are my runes all the way up there? I think they are. Yeah, whatever. It doesn't matter. Time's a burn o flame this guy. Okay. Uh, next is gargoyles, yeah? Gargoyles will give me some trouble, I'm sure. Yeah, guys, just keep in mind that this character is very overleveled for all of this down here. I'm currently level 131. Hey, you think you're supposed to come down here at, like, level, like, 60-ish? So I'm a little over leveled for it. A wee bit. Doing a world tour before the end? I mean, we have time. We're just kind of go around killing some stuff, you know? Come on in. What's up, Timmy? Max, I hope you're doing well. That paints one hell of a picture, uh, Jaden. One hell of a picture, dude. Let's see how we do against Gargs. I'm sure it's not going to be great. <laughs> you can you hear my confidence just oozing? Hey Tyler, welcome back.
Ouf. You know what? That felt good. It kind of, it, it kind of felt good to just absolutely dumpster on those guys. And hey, that felt really nice. Ten out of ten would do again. Hey guys, thank you for four hundred likes on the video as well. By the way, I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Now, once was poison breath. I actually, uh, the first one was about to, but I staggered him right as he was about to do it. Now, all this down here, we would have to go do uh, some of Ronnie's quests and stuff like that to get all this set up. I'm not going to do that. I just, uh, I'm just not feeling that energy right now. Not using a Roar Medallion? No. No, I think I have the space to do so. <laughs> yeah, I, I could, but I just don't use it enough. I actually use it pretty rarely. I was hoping it would do more damage there. Oh, there we go. What happened to Melina's eye? No one knows for sure. There's a theory that she might be the Glomide Queen. But no one knows for sure if that's the way of it as of yet. Okay, uh, what other bosses can we go dunk on real quick? Not a whole lot, huh? Not a whole lot. Am I going to be streaming Zelda? Yeah, I'll be streaming it tomorrow. Tomorrow at 4 p.m. Eastern Time, I'll be live with it. Uh... What other bosses can we go tackle real fast? Tree spirits are essentially asylum demons, yes. Oh, let's go kill Wormface. No, I'm not doing Fia stuff. I don't I don't want to set all that up. I'm feeling exceptionally lazy. <laughs> <laughs> Don't want to set that up. I'm down to kill Wormface, though. Oh, wormy boy. Yeah, that spell's fun, man. <laughs> that spell does ridiculous damage. I love it. It's so fun. I don't know. I just I just love when there's area of effect magic that can just wipe the floor with enemies. I don't know. I love that. 
again, I am over leveled, but still, it's it's just nice to see. I'm enjoying this. Yeah, let's go kill Lance Axe. Why not? I'm down for a little Lance Axe murder. Why not? Why not? And then after this, we can go tackle uh, Godfrey and Radagon and Elden Nerd. Did I just get the zap? I'm not sure what just killed me there. I saw I got smacked, but I didn't see what actually killed me. Where do you find Lance Axe round two? Right where I just was. Fabulous. Right here. If you'd like me to zoom out, there you go. To get there, you need to follow down this path. And then you go around the slope and then up it. Have you killed Rick, the door technician, yet in TH? If you're talking about in Star Wars, yes. You can't beat the game without killing him, in fact. Lance AX has speed murdered me twice. You will not be missing tomorrow's stream. Love to hear it, Aaron. Love to hear it. This dragon does not like me right now. Yeah, man. Ah, yeah. Oh, my God. That's a thing. We got him that time. Very nice. All right, guys. It's time for a little bit of uh, Macho Man Randy Savage. He goes by the uh, the name 
Godfrey in this game. But yeah. It is time. For the macho man, Randy Savage. And <laughs> he has John Cena on his back. Nice. Let's see. I guess we'll put one point in endurance, I guess. You know, why not? Why not, dude? Yeah, I can't imagine dragons smell very good. Yeah. lion yells real loud it's just a basic faith playthrough jumorn wait for Long it Long and hard didst thou that's all i needed to hear that's all i needed to hear man I'm getting wrecked here. Damn. Yeah, war cry here sucks too. No touching, man. My dodge timing on some of these attacks is just atrocious, dude. Oh. 
I was thinking that I could stagger him there, but I guess not. I didn't mean to do that. I might be dead because of that. <laughs> Why the blood tear? Because I had it equipped for Moog earlier. And I hardly ever change it. I might ask you if you're taking down Soldier of Godric, the door technician. Ah. Ah. I did. I did. Ironically, DLC news came out today. You liar. You liar. Kill Electo? No, because then I'd have to do Ronnie's quest to get all the way up there, and I am just not feeling that right now. Yeah, the reviews around uh, the new Zelda game are great, Alpha. I will be live streaming that game tomorrow, by the way, guys. So, so if you haven't marked it on your calendar or anything, or, you know, if you didn't know, well, now you do. Now you do. I'll be live streaming it tomorrow. It'll be great to have you here for it. Oh, that still hit me? All right, brother. Okay. Uh, I I hate that combo so much, dude. <laughs> All right. From Soft's parent company re released yearly earnings and projected for next year. DLC projected to be a year away. Interesting. Interesting. Yo, JJ, what's going on, man? Thank you for the membership here on YouTube. It means a lot, dude. Thank you for that. Only one Spire hit him? I am depressed. Oh, out of juice. All right, well, that, that attack... Uh 
against Radagon specifically is a little bit too RNG. He's too small of a target to really make it a value. So, melee time. Doing all right, JJ. Thank you very much for the generosity, man. Truly appreciate it. Just hanging out, playing video games, preparing for Legend of Zelda tomorrow. Really excited about it. What's up, Funk? Good to see you today as well. How you doing? Ah, too early on that. I couldn't run up for the parry because the other thing would have staggered me enough to pull it out of the parry, so just had to take that. Oh god, I'm dead. Never mind, I lived, bitch. <laughs> oh my god, Josh, dodge. Hello? Are oh, you doing this again? Okay, brother. Okay. What is going on here? What's up, Yoon? Getting ready to play some hockey tonight. Very nice. How goes the Elden Ring today? Well, we're on the final boss, so we've definitely kicked this game's ass today. We have definitely kicked this game's ass today. Eh, I feel like that damage could have been better. Oh, well. I mean, I'm going to go ahead and disagree with that, but all right. All right, man. So pretty.
Well, that sucks. So did that. Oh, that's a wall. That's a wall. That's a wall. All right. I will be streaming it tomorrow, Ryan. Tomorrow. <laughs> All right. So let's just go in parry heavy on this one with Radagon. Let's go in parry heavy. Oh, the water's definitely nerfing it, but it's only 10%. It's more that that last one completely missed because of the positioning of Elven Beast. It just completely missed. Oof. Okay, I kind of want to I kind of want to redo. Yeah. Feeling like a redo is in the uh, in order here. I keep going too early on that. Ah, too early again. That's fine. I'm just failing my timing so much today. Let's try to get a nice, clean fight with Radagon going, shall we? A nice, clean fight. You, do you think Radagon fights clean, guys? What's up, MAS and DGS? Hello, dudes. Gray Fox with a month of membership says, maybe in the end we were all from software all along. And the Elden Ring was in our hearts. Come on, John, get this guy and become Ring Lord. Oh, don't worry. Ring Lord incoming. Ah, ruined. We should get another break right here, actually. Yeah, look at that. Ah, too early. I'm so sad. No! Risky parry of the day. All right, go ahead and teleport. Oh, you're not teleporting for it? I just got bamboozled so hard with that. I didn't realize he was doing the uh, delayed one. Yikes, got me good. Got me good, my dude. Oh my God, I keep missing that. I will be live streaming Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom playthrough starting tomorrow, guys. Starting tomorrow. 
I see a lot of people talking about it. Yes, I will be here. Get some of that green tea energy. I know, I haven't had any green tea today, man. You know what, shark? Yeah, hold on. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. You guys ready? You ready? Tasty, tasty, tasty. All right, we go again. Let's do it. <laughs> Thank you again, Gray Fox, for the membership. Just kidding, I lived, bitch. Ah, failure. Feels so good to parry that lunge attack from him. Feels so good. Too early. Sudden stomp. Goodbye, sir. That was much better. Oh, what the hell just happened? How did I teleport? What? Claw? Night Hunter Nyx, thank you for the 10 BGN. The green tea of Perry. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. The green tea of Perry. The Perry juice. 
Thank you very much, Nyx. I appreciate it. I appreciate the generosity so much. Thank you, thank you. Oh! I tripped. Oh, I tried to run underneath it and it didn't work. Woe is me. Okay, that one hurt a lot. Thy unga befit befits a bunga. I like that. <laughs> oh. Oh God, oh God, oh God. Well, that was almost bad. All right, I laid down some damage there. I like it. And then I got smacked because I'm up against a wall again. Good God, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Okay, I live somehow, so that's cool. Uh-oh. I had no stamina! <laughs> I went completely greed mode and I used all of my stamina for that combo and then I got crucified for it. Quite literally crucified for it. Nice, dude. Nice. And that's why you don't burn all your stamina against Elven Beast. Yep. Very good. That was funny. <laughs> ah. Ah. Oh, nice. Nice. Hey, Abdul, welcome back.
Okay, bro. Goodbye. Okay, hold on. Time for the big sip. Nice. Nice, dude. Oh, I missed. Come here, Elden idiot. Come here. Oh, that other attack missed. Sad. Ah, okay. Oh, I missed the critical. That's all right. That camera angle is so wonky. Did a lot of damage there, though. I'm happy about that. Did it better, me or them? Clearly me, right? I always roll that far too early. Need to trust my instinct and go a little bit later. them you take that back right now right now like a little eye frames to get yourself through the Elden Stars, fellas. Wow, how did I know the timing for that? That was perfect. What the hell? Who is this guy? Who is he? Ultra Instinct, yeah. It's green tea plus. <laughs> that green tea power up, baby. Hi, Dobby. did a burn all right guys so we did it uh what are our ending choices probably just the one right yeah i think i think i think we only get the broken age because i did virtually no other work for any other endings on this playthrough but uh hey we did it it's done our casual faith playthrough has been completed very nice you officially become Lord of the Rings? Nice, dude. Nice. Nice, man. Can I pick a nickname? If so, I would like it for it to be Bilbo. 
But all right, job is done. Guys, listen, we are at the end of the game, which means the stream is just about over. But uh, listen, before you go, I do have a video on my channel that covers the game Redfall. Now, I know a lot of people did not like Redfall, and that's okay. But my video, I think you'll still like it. It is very entertaining. I had a blast making it. And it's uh, it's more around the entertainment uh, in a video than it is about the game. So be, make sure you check that out. The link is in the chat right now. And then from there, I will be back tomorrow at 4 p.m. Eastern Time to check out Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. A brand new Legend of Zelda game is officially releasing. And I'll be live streaming it tomorrow. I hope to see you here at 4 p.m. Eastern Time tomorrow for it. I know a lot of people don't have Nintendo Switches. And so, you know, I will be playing for us. <laughs> Mel and wife are here. Hello. The Redfall video was great. I'm glad you liked it, man. Okay. Oh, I should have took my mask off. Damn. Here, sir, you dropped something. Let me pick that up for you. Not sure how one drops their entire skull, but it happens, I guess. It happens. Play something else for an hour? Nah, man. I'm just going to call it a night on this, and then we'll be back tomorrow. It'll be nice to kind of just chill the rest of the evening, get, uh, get all of my stuff set up for tomorrow's stream and all that stuff. It's not like I'm going because I want to do nothing. I have stuff I have to prep for. I need to make sure that, you know, all the streaming equipment related to the Nintendo Switch is functioning. Yeah. The fallen leaves tell a story. <laughs> the fallen leaves tell a story about how this guy did nothing at all, and but so we have just a broken age. Ha! <laughs> became Elden Lord. Ha! <laughs> In our home, across the fog. Yeah, I mean, I, I know people want want to see more content from me and everything. Like, you want to keep me, want me to keep streaming. But listen, I have a ton of videos on my channel that are that are there for this exact reason. When I'm not streaming, but you still want content, I have you covered. Please go look at my channel. That's why those videos exist. Those specifically are there for that moment. An age of fracture. So yes, go check out some videos on my channel. Those exist specifically. For that reason. Response, Gray Fox, response. Who's gonna clean up all these leaves? Great question. Anyways, guys, I'm out of here. Thank you for 450 likes on the video. I really appreciate it. I really appreciate it. Thank you all for hanging out with me, and thank you for going to watch some videos on my channel. If you haven't seen the video, exclamation mark redfall. It would mean a lot to me if you would go watch that and give me give me your feedback. And tell me what you enjoyed, tell me what you didn't enjoy, all that stuff. I'm only looking to improve, you know? Only looking to improve. Thank you so much for hanging out here tonight, folks, and I'll see you all tomorrow at 4 p.m. Eastern Time for Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Our playthrough begins. I'm looking forward to it. Until then, be excellent to each other. Much love, folks. I'll see you soon.